In the mornings, I like to have uh, different types of teas. And sometimes uh, I like to go into my garden and get different herbs to make different types of teas. Uh, and today I am going to go and choose an herb that uh, I like to, to use and I'm going to tell you all the benefits of it. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natasha. I work to be self-sufficient, grow my own food and live off the land. And uh, I'm going to take you down to my uh, greenhouse here. Uh, and we're going to look at an herb that um, is very beneficial for your health. And it's uh, easy to grow. And... Um, it's just nice to have a variety of uh, different types of um, leaves, herbs, uh, things that you can use for not just food, but for teas, because I love um, tea actually in the morning. So um, I'm going to go in here. And, uh, all right. So um, the herb that I'm going to uh, talk about is called uh, dill. And um, dill is a herb that that uh, you can use in in many different things. You can use it for your soups, uh, your salads, and today I'm going to do a tea. Um, the uh, The benefits of the herb is um, it is has so many benefits for your health. I'm going to show it to you first here. This is. Dill. I'm gonna cut some here. It's got that light feathery uh, leaf. So some of the benefits of the dill are that it is uh, anti-inflammatory and it is loaded with antioxidants. Um, it is um, really good for heart health and brain health. I don't need a whole lot for my tea, but I might use it in some other dishes. Um, it helps to um, it help it can help to prevent like uh, stroke and any problems with your heart. Uh, it is also really good for your digestive system. Um, it's easy on the stomach. And it can, um, it, it, it helps with any type of bloating, um, bloating or gas. Uh, it also has a vitamin A in it. So it's really good for eye health as well. It has vitamin C, which again, um, is really good for the immune system. And it, um, also can help with lowering your cholesterol. Uh, help with lowering your cholesterol and also with lowering your blood sugar. So it's really good for diabetics as well. So I'm going to finish cutting most of this. I'm going to go make a tea. But um, yeah, uh, it has also a lot of B-complex in it. Uh, and uh, it also can help with um, insomnia. So if you can't get that sleep, it also helps you to relax. So you even might want to try it at, um, in the evening as well. Um, what I do for a tea, I just take these leaves and I pour boiling water over it and let it, um, steep for a couple of minutes and then I just drink it. <laughs> so, um, again, uh, this is going to be my tea for the morning and, um, yeah, dill is a great, great beneficial herb to have. Okay, thanks for watching.